Welcome to Mount Miseno. 535 meters up is the peak of this sacred mountain located here in Miyajima in the Hatsukaiji Hiroshima area. And we noticed today that there happens to be a ropeway. Is that like a lift? Let's go check it out. The Momiji Dani Park is one of the most famous Maple Leaf Valley parks in all of Japan because it has over 200 maple trees. These maple trees line across the Momiji Dani River in this pretty area. Misen has many courses you can take to get to different places. In our last video, we showed you the Tsutsumi Gaura Beach Park, and they have a course that goes to this beach as well. We can see the Momiji Dani Station where we'll be taking a ropeway. There are other walking paths as well, which you can take to get to the top of the mountain, as well as this Okunoin Temple. In ancient Chinese and Japanese folk tales, they say that a carp, if it can swim upstream and jump over the falls, it can turn into a dragon. All right, little guys, let's get swimming. Is that why Magikarp can turn into a Gyarados? Gyarados? I think it's pronounced Gyaradose. Oh, no. So we're almost there. We're at the crossroads where we decide to take the walking path or the cable car. And being young, strong, and spry, you know where I'm gonna go. Oh, cable car. Let's go. Here we go. Oh man. We came out of a dark tunnel into the bright light and uh, it's taken us 2.5 kilometers up to the top. Now we could have walked it, you know, it would have taken about 30 to 60 minutes, depending on the spring in your in your uh, step. But uh, yeah, we got this little cable car system that is taking us up to the very top, where we're gonna be able to see all of the Seto Naikai Sea and many of the other islands. This is a midway stop to the next station called the Shishiwa Station. In English, the Wild Boar Rock. We got a transfer and then it will take us up to the next station that will put us at the top. Well, we made it to the top of the Wild Boar Rock Station and now we've got one kilometer to get up to there. The Miyajima cable car and the observation tower at the top it's only open till 4 p.m. So, if you're not careful and you don't get on that cable car before 4, you might be taking the walk down. So we're getting to the top and we see a flat area here with a few temples or shrines. This area is called Reika Do, and Reika Do is a place where the eternal flame is held. And a guy who came here 1200, over 1,200 years ago, and a guy who goes by the name of Kubo Daishi was on a spiritual mission to light that eternal flame. So supposedly, he lit that flame, and it was the same flame that was used to light the eternal flame in the Hiroshima Peace Park as well. Let's go check out the flame. According to ancient tales, this eternal flame is just one of the seven wonders of Misen. So here we are, 535 meters above Miyajiba on Mount Misen, and we got the observation tower behind us that we're going to be checking out so we can see all of the beautiful conifer trees and the Seto Naikai Sea. We made it to the top, and here we are, getting to see the beautiful nature that has been provided for us today. And uh, wow, it sure is a breathtaking view. You can see the oyster farms, you can see so many boats moving back and forth from the islands here on the main part of Japan to Shikoku. You can see just so many different things. 
So here at Work Life Japan, we are trying to show you some of the most beautiful and exciting places about Japan and give you insights that you would not maybe be able to normally find. So go ahead, give us a subscribe if you would love to see more videos like this. Definitely recommend you to check out Misen Mountain here on Miyajima. We'll see you in the next one.